In this video, we'll guide you through the steps to connect your Samsung Galaxy Watch with Apple iPad models. Today we have Galaxy Active 2 and uh, iPad Air Force generation. And today we are going to learn how to pair these devices using uh, Bluetooth and also by using uh, the Galaxy Wearable app to sync notification as well as to manage apps and enhance your overall user experience. Remember, this is for those people who have Samsung Galaxy Watch, any model, any design, and this is perfect for users who wants to enjoy the fitness and health features of the Galaxy Watch Active 2, in my case. And uh, you can also use this with uh, different iOS devices such as iPads or iPhone. So let's start the video and learn how this process is taking place. All right, guys, uh, so let's open the Galaxy Watch on iPad and uh, for some reason the app is blocked as you can see unable to open the Galaxy Watch app. Your simulator does not support it. So we have a way out. I've also reset the watch which is now restarting. So we have another uh, iOS device which is currently on iOS 17 whereas the iPad itself is on uh, iOS 18. So let me take you there. There you can see that we have iPad on 17.6.1 and uh, the iPhone on 17.6.1. Sorry for the correction. So which means they both are uh, on the same operating system and shouldn't be a problem. But what Apple did actually, Apple have blocked this one. So the app is now reset. Let's move on towards the next step. Galaxy Watch Active 2 with uh, the serial number 1DE4 and uh, Galaxy Fit or Galaxy Watch or wearable is no longer working on this iPad which has the same operating system. So what we will do is we will go inside uh, our uh, older iPhone and uh, the once we are inside uh, the old iPhone's uh, purchase history you have to type Samsung Galaxy wearable and as you can see we downloaded this app back in 2018. Once that is downloaded and the app is reset we will open that and you will be able to see all available watch models on the screen once we hit the required model it will start the pairing process and uh, there you go the watch is now connected and uh, from here you can take on wait for the device to finish the installation process it will take a uh, couple of moments before the watch is uh, completely set up and ready to use obviously it's uh, a cellular watch which means you can also add data. So everything is set up and you can uh, pick and choose your favorite uh, screens or you can customize your watch from this section. So guys, uh, the only way out uh, to connect your Samsung Galaxy Watch or uh, Watch Active or Watch 2, 3, 4, 5 or the ones which are not supported with iOS is by going inside your uh, older iOS device and make sure you have downloaded the app in the past. Uh, there's also another way out if you don't have uh, your previous Apple ID linked with uh, the previously downloaded app. You can uh, ask a friend or a member of your family who have downloaded uh, and installed this app in the past and then sign in using their Apple ID and uh, then sign out from your device once the app is installed and then you can carry on with the basic installation process. It's very straightforward and simple. It's not going to work with uh, the newer uh, iPads and the iPhones unless you have downloaded in the past. So that's it for today's video on how to download and install it.